Order! 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 You are an incorrigible delinquent at times. <laughs> Behave yourself, man! Now, there was a bit of a reminder today, you might say, for the Labour Party in Wales, don't take anything for granted in politics. They thought their leader, Carwin Jones, was a shoo-in to reclaim his job as First Minister after last week's election. They are, after all, the biggest party. But an unlikely alliance of opposition parties, the Conservatives, Plaid Cymru and UKIP, had other ideas. Oh, and there was another microphone moment. He may have been wiping away beads of sweat, but the Welsh First Minister was also nursing a political bloody nose. Carwin Jones had narrowly avoided being deposed, a vote on a new First Minister perfectly dividing the two contenders. Even the rule book had to be consulted. Right, I'm not to remind me again. What do I do now? In one of the most unlikely coalitions in politics, Leanne Wood, leader of Welsh Nationalist Party Plaid Cymru, found herself being supported by those she had point-blank refused to work with. Susie Davis. The Welsh Conservatives and UKIP. Together, they attempted to prevent Labour from forming a minority government by taking over in Cardiff Bay. The Welsh Assembly has not until now had a reputation for dirty politics, but since the election last week, things have changed. UKIP have arrived, promising to stir things up. And it looks like it's working. The only Lib Dem in the Assembly, Kirsty Williams, thwarted this attempted coup, which had stunned Welsh politics. I am surprised, uh, perhaps not shocked, but the first thing that Plaid Cymru do after all the promises they made during the leaders' debates is to effectively to have done a deal with the Tories and with UKIP. I don't think anybody would expect that Plaid Cymru would do a deal with UKIP. Nothing has been discussed, offered, nothing has been sought, to, to be fair, in terms of a deal. Labour's opponents believe the party sees itself as being entitled to power here. Tonight, Labour still have power just, although the issue is far from settled. And if they can't agree, another Assembly election could be called. Rupert Evelyn, News at 10, Cardiff.